Hi there, I'm Shelly Wade, and I'm hanging out at the Screen Gym's MCAS Miramar red carpet screening of The Wedding Ringer, starring Kevin Hart, Kaylee Cuoco Sweeting, and Josh Gad. In just a few minutes, they're going to be walking the red carpet, and we're going to talk to them. Yeah, that's right. It's time to get down here to my sister. <laughs> <laughs> so, Kevin, I yes. have to ask you. I'm going to get to you guys. No, you don't have to. I, have no, no, no. To, <laughs> I don't have to get Kevin. to them. So I have to ask you, right along, debuted yes. the number one movie yeah, over did. the Dr. Martin Luther We're King Day yeah. holiday weekend. Right yeah. And now, the now the wedding ringer. <laughs> now the wedding ringer is opening on Dr. Martin Luther King holiday yes. weekend. Yes, We're thinking is about this going to become your right weekend? You know how Will Smith's at one point, he, you know, it was July 4th weekend. That was Big Willie weekend. That's what we're actually. Dr. King's holiday weekend is going to be your weekend now. Weekend. Really uh, now? The talk is all over. The buzz is amazing <laughs> about uh, about changing that to this. You know what? I mean, look. At the end of the day, if it happens, it happens. But let's just let's just say that I got another movie slated next year. <laughs> <laughs> so should we take Dr. King's name off the weekend? No, no. I need I need Dr. King. <laughs> That's how I guilt trick my people to come. <laughs> Say, Dr. King would want you to come. That's okay, it. you guys, without giving away too much of the movie, one of my favorite scenes was when Joe Namath came oh, out. Yeah. Oh, my God. Can you each tell me what your favorite scene of the movie were? Um, any scene that doesn't involve Kevin, I think. Just, I think that the screen really, it, it popped. I agree with you. Uh, when Kaylee and I are doing our stuff together, I think that that's when you see audiences really connect. And then when Kevin comes on, they, uh, they get distracted again and they just like, oh, this movie's falling apart. Uh, you know, and I would like to, and I would like to one up Kevin. They're calling September doldrums Josh Gadmon. <laughs> So that's when I'm taking over. Is when the rain season, when monsoon season starts. That's gonna be me. That's, that's I'm claiming that one. Nobody's claimed that one. That's mine. That's your time. That's your time. That's your time. That's your time. What's your weekend, Kelly? I, I don't even know what they're talking about. I, I've tuned this entire interview oh, out until I've, I've been talking. Oh, Kelly got <laughs> Kelly got movie star eyes now. You're gonna see what happens. Bright. No, I say one thing and they just they jump on you uh -huh. like little bugs. <laughs> and you got Kelly's a really? superstar. She shines so bright. She needs to protect herself. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have never despised two people more than I do. My name two. is Kaylee. Guess what? I have a TV show called the Big Bang. Sometimes. Oh yeah, by the way, make me put my glasses we're in season eight of that. We come back this week. Um, it would be great if you guys could tune on into that. That would be great. Well, I mean, Wedding Ringer's coming yeah, Friday. Yeah, yeah. Great, too. Yeah. You guys are all excellent in the movie. Thank, Good thank luck you. on it. Thank, thank you so much. It. Thank, thank you. you. Okay, here we go, here we go. What's up, San Diego? It's Shelly Wade with the new 95.7 Kiss FM. <laughs> Give it up for the gang from the Wedding Ringer. <laughs> so you guys, this is the screenwriter, Jay Lavender. <laughs> Josh Gad, what's the awesome and Doug? Cuoco Sweeting! And of course, Kevin Hart! So we're going to take some uh, questions from the audience in just a few, but I would love to know, Jay, as the writer of the movie, what was your experience? Where you, did you have a lot of uh, choice in who played uh, the characters? Uh, I had absolutely no choice, which turned out to be the best thing possible. Really now? Uh, I co-wrote this movie with Jeremy Garlick, who also directed the movie, did an incredible job. Uh -huh. They're all up here because of Clint Culpepper, the head of Sony Screen Gems. Yeah. the vision for casting Kevin and Josh. Jeremy combined with him to cast Kaylee as well, and that's yeah. why they're here. I was saying to Kevin on the uh, red carpet that uh, the Martin Luther King holiday weekend is turning out to be your weekend, much like uh, Will Smith's weekend was the July 4th weekend. This is Kevin's weekend. Uh, it's shaping up the <laughs> you know. I hope so. Thus far, it's been successful for me. I've had movies come out in the past. Ride Along did very well last year, so. On the same weekend, yeah. So, uh, you know, we wanted to follow in those footsteps we'll release a ready ring. But this this is the movie that I'm most proud of. This is the first time I got to do a rated R comedy and really be that vert. Hey, get that baby out of here. <laughs> I would like to know, I asked you this on the red carpet, what was your individual favorite uh, scene in the movie to do? I know it's, it's hard because so many scenes were funny. I have to say the lighting grandma on fire will always be, <laughs> because when can you actually say those words in a sentence? That know, was right? uh, really interesting to shoot and um, I found it fascinating. Great stunt. 
Uh, I, I love the idea of the football scene, uh, but then when I had to play a game called football, <laughs> I, it was not as successful as I think they had hoped I would be. Uh, I have tricky fingers. My favorite scene is the one where me and Ice Cube were in the car. We're, uh, we're driving, I missed we're, him! I missed him in the movie! To, that's a different what? movie entirely. What are we talking about? <laughs> wait, wait, what are we promoting? What are we promoting? Tell me. <laughs> Wedding ringer! That's right! Alright, I'm back! It was when me and Josh are at the pool, we're sitting in the lawn chairs, and we're giving backstory. I'm mm -hmm. telling him how I became the wedding ringer, and he's telling me why he's in a position that he's in. I like that scene because it's the first time you get to see these guys bond. And the fact that this movie is ultimately about the road to friendship between these guys, yeah. you gradually see it build. So you guys really had great chemistry on screen together. Really had great chemistry. Thank you. Can you uh, speak on that? Uh, well, you and know, was it hard to develop it, or was it? Did it come naturally? Well, it was tough getting Josh to a place where he could be good. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it was tough. So don't forget, guys. Hashtag Wedding Ringer. All right, and it comes out this Friday, the 16th. Give it up for the gang from the Wedding Ringer. Hey, get that baby out of here. <laughs> well, it was tough getting Josh to a place where he could be good. Uh, yeah, it was tough. I started, I started working with acting coaches yeah. early on in the process. <laughs> that baby. One more it's going to be me and the baby. No, you heaven know. can't get past this that I did no planning in my wedding. Oh. Thank you for protecting us. I mean that. What about it? Thank you so much. 
Y'all see the movie, people? Go talk about it on social media. Hashtag wedding ring. I'm going to tweet you back. I had a ball today. Now get up and get out of here right now. All right, you guys. Once again, the screenwriter, Jay Lavender, Josh Gad, Kelly Coyco Sweeting, and Kevin Hart. Give it up for them. The Wedding Ringer. It comes out this Friday the 16th. And also, hashtag Wedding Ringer when you're uh, doing your social media. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for your service. And please listen to the new 95.